Hi guys, it's Quinn's Ideas here, and it looks like we actually got another image from the upcoming 2020 Denny Villeneuve Dune movie. Now this appears to be an image of Paul Atreides and Gurney Halleck. Now, I'm pretty sure I know what scene this is. To me, this looks like the Spice Harvester scene. Now, if you've read Dune or if you've even seen the older movie, then you know there is a scene where Paul Atreides, the Duke Leto, Gurney Halleck, and Liet Kynes actually fly over the desert in a thopter, just taking a tour of Arrakis. Leto spots a worm sign, and they see that a worm is approaching the place where a spice harvester is collecting spice. The reason that the worm is attacking is because worms follow rhythmic motions, they're drawn to it, and the rumbling of a spice harvester is definitely something that attracts it. And also the spice is something that attracts the worms, I believe, as well. What ends up happening, without getting too spoilerific, is that some men are in danger and they stop the thopter to try and save some of them. And to me, that looks like what seems to be happening here. It looks like Paul and Gurney are looking down and about to reach and grab onto someone else that is about to get onto the thopter. I still say these are the best still suit designs that we've seen so far. They really do look functional in my opinion. We can't see much of the thopter or the ship that they're in, but it looks pretty much like what you would expect. Obviously Josh Brolin and Tim Boutet Chalamet look great in their roles. A curious thing about the scene, I think thematically that I'll just point out now, is that it's meant to illustrate what distinguishes the Atreides from someone like the Harkonnens. Uh, the Harkonnens would have left those men to die, but the Atreides inspire loyalty and love because they will go out and save people when they are in need of help. And another reason why I bring that up is because I did my video the other day, Is Paul Atreides the bad guy? Because it's important to point out that the road to hell is kind of paved with good intentions, and I know that's kind of, people say that a lot, but it's true ultimately. When Frank Herbert said he was writing this whole thing about charismatic leaders, what he's talking about is that people are fallible, people change, people die, and then their systems are left over to, you know, less capable people that don't have the concerns of everyone else in mind. But other than that, great image. I'm super excited to see if we get anything else. I know Brian Herbert said that there was more things coming this week. So I'm excited to see what else they have. And of course, I'll be covering all the news here on this channel. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you like and subscribe for more. And if you want to learn more about the Dune saga as a whole, check out the Dune playlist on the front of this channel. Peace, guys. Special shout out to my top patrons, Trini Girl, Joseph Rosner, Milton Christopher Appling, Richard Hess, Deus Technica, Juliana Illion, The Collier Report, Paula, Zach Glazar, Matthew Snyder, Jim Nimeth, Alex Butler, and Frederick Nordland. Hey guys, if you're interested, check out the link in the description to get put on the mailing list for my upcoming horror graphic novel, Tadia.